So I'm reading Mary Mitchell today, and she's telling everybody it's an American tragedy what happened to Jesse Jackson Jr. and his wife Sandy. You know, no, the American tragedy is the morons who live in his district kept electing him. That's the American tragedy. When he had Piatone, and that was his big deal, the airport, that's his claim to fame, right? He didn't get it done. Then Obama comes in and basically takes everything that Jesse Jackson Jr. thought he had coming, including the presidency someday. No, it's not an American tragedy. That's Mary Mitchell. Boo-hoo. Hey, Mary, why don't you call it like you see it? The American tragedy is the guy's a crook, okay, and he finally got caught. The tragedy is that he probably did it for a long, long time, okay? So, so get off the, the, the pity party, if you will, okay? Now, as far as what's going to happen next, who knows? I mean, they're doing plea deals and everything else. It is a joke. Dwight Howard, uh, I, I'll tell you something, folks. You want a cancer on your team, he may be the guy. Now, I want everybody to read tomorrow's Daily Herald, if you can, uh, and, and check out what I wrote about uh, Dwight Howard and where he will be going, okay? I got a good idea. He's leaving the Lakers, uh, and I have an alternative uh, for the Lakers if they'd like to try it, but I don't think they'll bite on it. So check it out in the Daily Herald tomorrow. The weather outside today is... What it is. I mean, getting ready for St. Patrick's Day. What can I tell you? It's a little brisk out, a little chilly, you know, but it's okay. We're not getting hit by a lot of snow. Oh, this just in, major shooting on the Strip on Las Vegas Boulevard. Uh, on the Strip, if you will, right in front of the Bellagio. A running gun battle. Uh, three people killed, three others injured as of now. We'll have more information on that down the line. Well, really, tomorrow. Uh, you've been listening uh, to 30 and 5 on 560 WIND.